Ever pondered what makes Belgium so unique? Let's count down 20 fascinating facts you probably didn't know about Belgium. Nestled in the heart of Europe, the intriguing land of Belgium is more than meets the eye. A country as small as Belgium, you might wonder what's there to explore, but hold your thoughts, because what Belgium lacks in size, it makes up for it with an astounding array of unique qualities. Belgium, a country known for its historic cities, diverse culture, and yes, delicious waffles, is also home to an array of languages. Here, you'll find people conversing in Dutch, French, and German, all official languages of the country. A linguistic kaleidoscope, isn't it? This linguistic diversity is one of the many fascinating aspects of Belgium, a testament to its rich cultural heritage and history. Speaking of history, Belgium's past is as varied and colorful as its present. From being the battleground for Europe during the World Wars to becoming the headquarters of the European Union, Belgium has witnessed significant chapters in world history. The historic background of this nation is a blend of triumphs and trials, a story that's waiting for you to discover. Starting with fact number 20, Belgium, a canvas of artistic brilliance. Belgium's artistic heritage is something that sets it apart. Its rich history has seen the rise and fall of many artistic movements, each leaving an indelible mark on the country's cultural landscape. In the 15th century, the Flemish primitives, including renowned artists such as Jan van Eyck and Roger van der Weyden, pioneered oil painting techniques that revolutionized the world of art. Fast forward to the 20th century, and Belgium was at the forefront of the Art Nouveau movement with Victor Horta's architectural masterpieces. Today, Belgium continues to nurture its artistic roots with a vibrant contemporary art scene that's taking the world by storm. From world-class museums housing priceless artworks to street corners adorned with murals, art in Belgium is not just confined to galleries, it's a part of everyday life. So for all you art lovers out there, Belgium is a place where you can truly indulge your artistic senses. Let's dive deeper into Belgium's artistic allure as we continue our journey. Let's crunch into fact number 19, the popular French fries are actually Belgian. Yes, you heard it right. Despite the name, French fries, or frites as they are locally known, originated in Belgium. The story goes back to the 17th century when Belgian fishermen, unable to fish due to harsh winters, cut potatoes in the shape of fish and fried them. This humble substitute soon gained popularity and started spreading across borders. However, during World War I, American soldiers tasted these delicious fried potatoes in the French-speaking part of Belgium and mistakenly attributed them to France, hence the name French fries. Today, Belgium's love for fries runs deep. From traditional friteries serving piping hot fries in a paper cone with a variety of mouth-watering sauces to gourmet restaurants offering sophisticated frites dishes, the French fry is an undeniable part of Belgium's gastronomic identity. So next time you dig into a portion of French fries, remember you're savoring a piece of Belgium's culinary history. Moving on to fact number 18, Belgium is the birthplace of some of the world's most beloved comic strips. This is where the ink hits the paper and imagination takes flight. Belgium has a rich history of comic book artistry dating back to the early 20th century. The country has given us iconic characters like Tintin, the Smurfs, and Lucky Luke, to name a few. These stories have transcended generations and continue to captivate audiences worldwide. Belgian comic strips are not just about entertainment, they also reflect the country's culture, history, and social dynamics. Brussels, the heart of Belgium, houses the Belgian Comic Strip Center, an entire museum dedicated to the celebration of this art form. The city's streets are adorned with large murals of comic strip characters, making it a living comic book. So, whether you're a comic book enthusiast or not, the vibrant comic strip culture of Belgium is sure to draw you in. Coming in at number 17, let's delve into the linguistic diversity of Belgium, a country with three official languages. Belgium is a language lover's paradise. With Dutch, French, and German as its official languages, it offers a unique linguistic landscape. While Dutch is spoken by the majority in the Flanders region, French is the language of choice in Wallonia and Brussels. The German-speaking community, though small, has its stronghold in the eastern part of the country. Belgium's linguistic diversity is a testament to its rich cultural heritage and complex history. It also reflects the country's strategic location at the crossroads of Germanic and Latin cultures. This multilingualism 
is not just about communication. It's a part of Belgian identity and everyday life. So if you're planning a visit, make sure to brush up on your bonjour and goye dag. It's not just about speaking the language, it's about living the Belgian way. Stepping in at number 16, we're diving into the frothy world of Belgian beers. Belgium is not just about chocolates and fries, it's also a beer paradise. With over 1,600 different types of beer, this small country has a big beer culture. Belgian beer brewing dates back to the Middle Ages, and it's more than just a drink. It's a way of life. Each beer has its own unique flavor profile and is often served in its own distinctively shaped glass. From the strong dark Trappist beers brewed in monasteries to the tart and fruity Lambic beers, Belgium offers a brew for every taste. The Belgian beer culture is so significant that it has been recognized by UNESCO as an intangible cultural heritage. So when in Belgium, do as the Belgians do. Enjoy a pint of their finest brew, but remember, with great beer comes great responsibility. Cheers to that. At number 15, let's carve out some time to explore a lesser known yet fascinating aspect of Belgian culture, the world's largest sand sculpture festival. Each summer, the Belgian coastline transforms into an impressive outdoor gallery, showcasing the artistry and creativity of international artists. The Sand Sculpture Festival, held in the coastal city of Ostend, attracts hundreds of thousands of visitors each year. Artists from around the globe gather here, turning ordinary sand into extraordinary masterpieces. They craft intricate sculptures, some reaching up to 12 meters high, depicting everything from mythical creatures and famous landmarks to scenes from popular culture. The festival is a testament to Belgium's love for art in all its forms, even the transient beauty of sand art. So if you find yourself in Belgium during summer, don't miss this sandy spectacle. It's a reminder that art, like life, is fleeting, and we must enjoy its beauty while it lasts. Sliding in at number 14, we have an intriguing fact that's bound to surprise you. Belgium boasts more castles per square kilometer than any other country. With over 3,000 castles scattered across its landscape, Belgium is a paradise for history buffs and fairy tale lovers alike. These castles range from medieval fortresses with moats and drawbridges to opulent chateaus reflecting the splendor of the Renaissance and Baroque periods. Some of these castles are hidden away in dense forests, while others stand proudly in the heart of cities. Many of these architectural gems have been meticulously preserved or restored, offering a fascinating glimpse into Belgium's rich heritage. Some castles, like the stunning Gravenstein in Ghent or the elegant Chateau de Belleway, are open to the public, while others have been converted into hotels, offering a unique stay that transports guests back in time. So next time you're in Belgium, why not swap your hotel room for a castle chamber? It's time to live your fairy tale dream. Coming in at number 13, we strike a note that resonates with music lovers worldwide. Belgium is the birthplace of the saxophone. This instrument with its soulful sound and dynamic range was invented in the early 19th century by Adolf Sax, a native of Dinant, Belgium. Adolf's innovative design combined the power of brass instruments with the agility of woodwinds, creating a unique musical voice that would revolutionize the world of music. From jazz clubs in New Orleans to symphony orchestras in Vienna, the saxophone has found its place in almost every genre of music. In Dinan, you can visit the Maison de Monsieur Sac, an interactive museum dedicated to the life and work of this ingenious inventor. The city also hosts an annual saxophone festival drawing musicians from around the globe and, as a tribute to its native son, the cityscape of Dinant is dotted with colorful saxophone statues representing different countries. So next time you listen to a saxophone's enchanting melody, remember its humble beginnings in a small Belgian town. Sliding into the 12th spot is an intriguing fact that might surprise you. Belgium has the highest density of art collectors in the world. Yes, you heard it right. This small European nation is a veritable haven for art enthusiasts and collectors. The country's rich, historical, and cultural heritage, coupled with its strong appreciation for the arts, has fostered a thriving art market. From medieval masterpieces to contemporary creations, the Belgian art scene is as diverse as it is vibrant. The country is home to numerous art galleries and auctions, 
with works ranging from the old masters to avant-garde artists. In addition, Belgium hosts one of the world's leading contemporary art fairs, Art Brussels, attracting collectors, curators, and art lovers from across the globe. This deep-seated love for art is not only confined to the elites. In fact, it's a part of everyday life in Belgium with public art installations and street art adorning the cities, making art accessible to all. So if art is your thing, Belgium is your destination. Sliding into number 11, let's tantalize your taste buds with Belgium's culinary prowess. Belgium is not only a paradise for comic lovers and chocolate aficionados, but also a gastronome's delight it holds the record for the highest density of Michelin-starred restaurants in Europe. This small country is a culinary giant, offering an astonishing array of gourmet experiences. From traditional Belgian cuisine to innovative fusion dishes, the gastronomy scene here is as diverse as it is delicious. The Belgians' love for food is deeply rooted in their culture, with each region boasting its own unique dishes and specialties high quality ingredients, a deep respect for tradition, and a dash of creative innovation are the key ingredients of Belgian cuisine. It's no surprise then that Belgium is home to so many Michelin-starred restaurants. So whether you're a foodie seeking the ultimate gastronomic experience or simply looking to enjoy some good food, Belgium has got you covered. Coming in at number 10, did you know that Belgium is the world's leading exporter of billiard balls? That's right. This small European nation holds a surprising record in the world of sports. Belgium is home to Saluc SA, a company located in Calanel, which has been manufacturing top quality billiard balls under the Aramith brand since the 1920s. The company uses a unique phenolic resin to produce balls that are exceptionally resistant to wear and tear, maintaining their shape and color over time. This has made them the preferred choice for billiard competitions worldwide. The company exports these high-quality billiard balls to over 85 countries, making Belgium the undisputed leader in the global billiard ball market. So the next time you're lining up the perfect shot on the pool table, remember, there's a good chance that ball came from Belgium. Sliding into number nine, Belgium is home to the world's oldest shopping arcades. Yes, you heard it right. Belgium boasts of the St. Hubert Royal Galleries located in Brussels, which opened its doors to the public in 1847. These elegant glass-roofed arcades are a testament to the architectural prowess of the 19th century, and they have stood the test of time. Housing a variety of shops, boutiques, cafes, and even a theater, the St. Hubert Royal Galleries offer a unique shopping experience that blends history, culture, and retail therapy. Whether you're looking for high-end fashion, exquisite Belgian chocolate, or a cozy spot to sip on a coffee while people watching, the Royal Galleries have got you covered. So, next time you're in Brussels, make sure to add this historic shopping destination to your itinerary. Remember, shopping in Belgium isn't just about retail, it's a walk through history. Before we dive into the world of Belgian chocolates, there's another interesting fact we need to share. At number eight, Belgium is the birthplace of the body mass index, commonly known as BMI. Yes, that's right. This widely used measure of body fat was developed by the Belgian mathematician, statistician, and sociologist Adolphe Quetelet in the early 19th century. Quetelet was a pioneer in the field of social physics, and his work has had a profound impact on modern statistics and sociology. His Quetelet Index, now known as the BMI, is a simple calculation that uses a person's height and weight to assess whether they are underweight normal weight, overweight, or obese. It's a handy tool used by health professionals around the world to screen for weight-related health issues. So next time you calculate your BMI, remember it's a Belgian invention. Now, let's move on to something a little more indulgent. Belgian chocolates. Sliding in at number seven, we have a noteworthy fact about Belgium's political landscape. This small European nation holds the record for having the highest number of female ministers in the world. Yes, you heard that right. Belgium is leading the charge in gender equality in politics. Since the early 2000s, the country has implemented mandatory gender quotas for political parties. As a result, women's representation in Belgian politics has seen a significant increase, with women now holding key positions in government. It's a testament to Belgium's commitment to equality and inclusivity. 
This might come as a surprise to many, but Belgium has always been a pioneer in women's rights. In fact, it was one of the first countries in the world to grant women the right to vote. So hats off to Belgium for setting a sterling example of gender equality in politics. Now from the corridors of power, let's transition to the tantalizing world of Belgian chocolates. Glittering at number six, did you know that Belgium is the world's leading exporter of diamonds? This might come as a surprise, but Belgium's city of Antwerp has been the diamond capital of the world for over five centuries. With a history dating back to the 15th century, Antwerp's diamond district, also known as the Diamond Quarter, boasts over 380 workshops that cut, polish, and trade around 84% of the world's rough diamonds. This small district is also home to the Antwerp World Diamond Center, which plays a pivotal role in the global diamond industry. Talk about a hidden gem. The city is renowned for its high quality diamonds and skilled diamond cutters who bring out the brilliance in each stone. Whether you're in the market for an engagement ring or just fascinated by these precious stones sparkle, a visit to the Diamond Quarter is a must when in Belgium. As we leave behind the shimmering allure of diamonds, let's delve into the mouth-watering world of Belgian chocolates. Whooshing in at number five, did you know that Belgium has the highest number of cyclists in the world? Quite the feat for a small country, isn't it? Belgium's cycling culture is deeply ingrained in its society and is considered an essential mode of transport and a popular pastime. The country's flat terrain, combined with an extensive network of well-maintained cycle paths, makes it a paradise for cyclists. The love for bicycles doesn't stop at commuting. Belgium also hosts some of the most prestigious cycling events in the world, like the Tour of Flanders and Liège-Bastogne-Liège. These races attract professional cyclists and enthusiastic fans from all corners of the globe. Whether you're a cycling enthusiast or a casual rider, Belgium offers a unique blend of urban exploration and scenic countryside rides. So why not grab a bike and join the cycling revolution? As we pedal away from the cycling scene, let's dive into the mouth-watering world of Belgian chocolates. Sliding in at number four, we're brewing up a storm with an intoxicating fact about Belgium. Did you know that this small nation holds the record for the highest number of breweries per capita? That's right. Belgium is a beer lover's paradise with over 300 active breweries scattered across the country. Each brewery has its unique recipes and brewing methods, resulting in a staggering variety of beers. Whether you prefer a light and crisp lager, a strong and dark Trappist, or a sour and fruity Lambic, Belgian breweries have got you covered. The country's beer culture is so significant that UNESCO has included it in the list of the intangible cultural heritage of humanity. So whether you're in a cozy pub in Brussels or a traditional brewery in the countryside, you're never far from a delicious pint of Belgian beer. Now let's hop over to the next scene and indulge in the sweet world of Belgian chocolates. Crashing through at number three, Belgium is not just about great beer and delicious chocolates, but it's also a treasure trove of UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Yes, you heard it right. This small European nation holds the record for the highest number of UNESCO World Heritage Sites per capita. Belgium's 13 UNESCO sites range from historical city centers like Bruges and Ghent to unique mining sites and the four lifts on the Canal du Sonner, which are technological masterpieces of the 19th century. Not to forget, the unique architectural wonders of Victor Horta, a pioneer of the Art Nouveau movement. These sites offer a fascinating glimpse into the past, showcasing Belgium's rich cultural heritage, architectural grandeur, and its unique contribution to the world's history. So, if you're a history buff or an architecture enthusiast, Belgium is your perfect destination. And now, let's melt into the next scene as we explore the sweet world of Belgian chocolates. Taking the second spot, we delve into the heart and soul of Belgium, its capital, Brussels. Known for its cosmopolitan nature, Brussels is a city that beautifully blends old and new. With narrow, winding streets opening up to modern art installations and skyscrapers, it's a city that will keep you on your toes. The Grand Place, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is the city's main attraction. With its opulent guild halls and the magnificent town hall, it's a testament to the city's rich past. Let's not forget the Atomium, a unique piece of architecture that offers stunning views of the city. 
and of course the mannequin piss, a quirky little statue that's become an emblem of the city's rebellious spirit. But Brussels is not just about landmarks. It's a city of culture, art, fashion, and most importantly, food. From mouth-watering waffles and fries to its world-famous chocolates and beer, Brussels truly encapsulates the essence of Belgium. So are you ready to embark on this journey through the beating heart of Belgium? Let's go. In at number one, Belgium is world-renowned for its chocolates, producing over 220,000 tons each year. Now. Let's unwrap the chocolatey tale of this exquisite delicacy. Belgian chocolate has its roots as far back as the 17th century when the country was under Spanish occupation. Since then, it's been a sweet journey to global fame. Belgian chocolates are known for their high quality, achieved through a unique blend of the finest cocoa beans and a meticulous manufacturing process. Unlike other countries, Belgium strictly regulates its chocolate production to ensure the use of pure cocoa butter. This is what gives Belgian chocolate its signature smooth texture and rich flavor. Variety is the spice of life, and Belgian chocolates are no exception. From pralines, truffles, and ganaches, to bars and figurines, there's a treat for every palate and occasion. Now who's up for a chocolatey treat? And there you have it, 20 unique and fascinating facts about Belgium. From the intriguing history that paints every corner of this country, to the irresistible allure of its world-renowned chocolates and the undeniable charm of its fries. We've navigated the colorful streets of the comic strip capital, explored the multilingual majesty that makes Belgium a cultural melting pot, and savored the abundance and diversity of its beer culture. We've also immersed ourselves in the heart and soul of Belgium, the vibrant city of Brussels. Belgium is a tapestry of experiences, a country where tradition and innovation dance in perfect harmony. Each fact we've shared today is a testament to Belgium's unique charm, a charm that's steeped in history, flavored by culinary excellence, and punctuated by cultural richness. We hope you enjoyed the countdown. Remember, there's always more to discover about the enchanting land of Belgium.